Hey, hey, y'all, what's going on? This is Gregory Brooks back here with another quick, enjoyable message for you all today on this glorious, blessed day. I hope y'all been having a great day today. Hopefully y'all can hear me. I got my earphones in and I'm working right now, but I really just wanted to kind of get his message as I was working. So right now I'm, <laughs> I'm currently building a chicken coop and a, uh, a rabbit coop. Um, and throughout the day, as I was working, I had to redo a few things as far as like, I don't know if I can put my camera. I don't think I can. Like the hole, I had to dig like holes and all of that, a certain inch. And some of them, as I was getting a little tired, cause you know, you really do have to dig the holes and, um, you know, get down there to the certain inch that, that you, that's on a blueprint. And I, I ain't gonna lie, I got tired on some of them. And I just kind of rushed it, I have did it. And I was just kind of trying to wing it. And as I did that, looking back at my work, it didn't work out. I literally had to go back with any time I was a little bit lazy on something. And um, I had to do more than what I was already bargained to do because I didn't just, you know, get through that, through that one moment of, um, you know, doing what I was supposed to do throughout the process. And so, you know, um, as I was doing that, I was starting to realize, you know, in a, in a word that that's kind of how life is, you know, when it comes to the process of anything, really just life in general, when it comes to the process of life, when it comes to growing, when it comes to learning, getting education, meeting people, uh, figuring things out, figuring yourself out, figuring um, situations out, literally like y'all, it is so much when it comes to the process of life. One thing about it, we cannot rush things. Like we cannot rush things because if we rush things, what, what we will end up doing is we'll set ourselves up for a repeating we'll rush ourselves excuse me we'll we'll set ourselves up um to have to go back because one thing about god the creator of this world not the god of this world the creator of this world it's a big difference the creator of this world is a perfect entity meaning it's not it's not gonna gonna overlap things it's not gonna have do things it's not gonna skip things or it's not going to give less energy into something um you know throughout the process it's going to always be you know it's going to always be that same type of grit to get through whatever the creator is trying to create so with us when we do um when we do lazy things like like what i did <laughs> i wasn't trying to measure a hole i literally i don't i ain't even got it around me right now i know i'm just talking y'all but y'all i hope y'all used to this this is how i am this is my youtube i ain't even got it around me i wish i could show y'all it's over there i ain't gonna get up but i had a ruler and all i had to do y'all with the ruler with the measure uh tape is pull it out and see how much inches it was but instead you know i i got a little tired um and i was thinking that i knew what i was doing i let my ego get to me and thinking that um the hole was 12 13 inches you know it wasn't so it's just i had to i put more work on myself because for one i got a little tired for two i thought i knew what i was doing and that's just my message to y'all i don't want to just kind of be rambling but that's my message to y'all for today please stick to the process man like please stick to the process don't rush it be like enjoy the process enjoy the process you really have to trust god when it comes to him revealing things when it comes to god um sending things your way when it comes to god showing you certain things um giving you strengths things of that nature so you really have to trust the process i know we say that a lot in this world but i don't think a lot of people really meditate on it we have to trust the process we can't rush anything the moment we rush something we will literally open a door of the same the same um the same hallway that we was walking that we was trying to walk out of the same hallway that we opened we opened that door and it's the same hallway that's that's what happens when we rush things it happens when we try to do things our own way too like i said when i was trying to 
um, make the hole. What I was supposed to have did was put the measure tape in there and make sure it was 12 inches, then put the uh, post in there. But what I did, I did it my own way. I dig the hole and just kind of with my eyesight kind of figured it was there. It was like three inches off, but you know, still it has to be, these have to be 12 inches exact. So, um, yeah, that's just that's just the message that I wanted to give to y'all today. Um, I really hope that somebody can receive this message. You know, don't don't rush stuff. Trust the process. And I seen a post, and I'm kind of going off a uh, topic now. I seen a post, and I need to go and start. I need to be working too. I seen a post where it said on Facebook, um, what was it? Patience, patience is a doorway for tribulation. When I tell y'all, that is such a lie. Like, that is such a lie, y'all. Don't, no, it, it's not. Like, patience is a virtue. <laughs> patience does not open doors to tribulation. But I can say you do need to have, um, you do need to have discernment and the needed revelation to understand what you waited for. Um, but yeah, patience is not, patience doesn't open any type of tribulation you really because you know what opens tribulation you stepping into something fast you get into, into something fast something that this generation don't understand a lot and i i struggle with this myself and uh over the recent years but i'm starting to you know god has revealed some things to me when it comes to following your heart you can't follow your emotions it's a big difference between following your heart and following your emotions a lot of people tell us young people you know follow your follow your heart follow your heart do this do that in reality the only we are just emotional beings we we going through we going through emotions we we fall in our emotions so you know that's just another thing but yeah y'all please 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 trust the process that's the message of this video i i know i've been rambling but trust the process y'all trust the process um everything is gonna be good everything is gonna be okay you have to always remember that that everything is going to be okay you're gonna be all right that's just my that's just gregory brooks reminding y'all on this good old blessed day okay so whoever is watching this i don't know if i'm gonna upload it right now because i'm um i'm i'm at work right now but when I do, hopefully it, it is received at the right time. But y'all have y'all a blessed day today. Um, to anyone that watches my YouTube, hopefully you're still watching. I know I be talking y'all. Like I said, this is my YouTube. This is how I talk, okay? But um, to the people that are still watching this video, make sure you have you a good day. Make sure you have you a good weekend. It's Friday. I'm gonna make sure I post this video before the day over with. So it's Friday. Um, do something do something peaceful this weekend you know make sure that you just getting make sure you're getting rest oh my god i'm in this video y'all jeez i'm in this video but rest y'all make sure you're getting rest you can't do anything you can't do anything if you allow yourself to get consumed in work you can't do anything if you allow yourself to get consumed in uh social media like you have to you have to take your breaks from social media i don't care if you're a influencer you have to take your breaks from social media that's what i do i think a lot of people was expecting me to come out the gate and post every single time which i actually said that i was gonna post like a video um like one video every every week and i do want to stick to that um however when it comes to social media we do have to take our breaks no matter what no matter what if you're an influencer a vlogger um wh whatever you have to do to stay on social media you still just have to make sure you're you're taking that break those phases where you just kind of tuned out of it because if you're consumed in it you know it's just th this another conversation going on yeah I i'm finna get into whole another conversation but when you get too consumed in social media you're not able to really focus on your process you're not able to focus on the things that you're trying to do like righteously you're not able to really like focus you know because you're looking at every single thing you're looking at a whole bunch of different things especially like with tiktok i i've always struggled to get on tiktok because it's just i don't know i don't know that app. i don't think that app for me but um it's just so much in the algorithm so many different things so it's like um 
you just have to take those breaks to really recoup and you know just keep your plan going you have to keep the plan going because this world y'all oh jesus christ man this world this world this world it is turning to something for real this world is going into a phase that none of us have seen i don't even think pr people in the past have, have have experienced like the emotions that's going throughout this earth like spiritually um it's just a lot so right now my message to y'all is to trust the process and do not rush it don't rush the process i don't care if if, if 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 it's feeling if it's feeling stagnant like you're not you don't become a lazy person by you know kind of seeing what god is going to do for you you know you really you really have to wait it out but you have to keep praying and stand in tune with god so he can keep you updated all right so make sure y'all continue to fast pray so god can keep you updated on things throughout your process um and whatever that you're expecting like you're gonna be all right okay but i gotta finish this last nail i'm on my last nail right now but uh y'all please have y'all a good day have y'all a good weekend um i really really hope this message encourages someone on today because it encouraged me as i was as i was doing my work i'm like greg so you really wanna you really gonna do half a double s that uh hole that you dug just for you to go back and have to redig the whole thing wasting time so that's just my message to y'all but y'all have y'all a blessed day okay i'm gonna end this miss i'm gonna end this right now but y'all have y'all a good day um what is some messages stay positive make sure y'all um make sure y'all encourage somebody on today you know make sure y'all is sticking to your morals in life that's one more thing i y'all at this point i'm just it's, whatever is coming to my heart morals y'all make sure you stick to your morals in life um it's a lot of people that try to antagonize you uh with with whatever mindset that you have with whatever vision that you have whatever just any 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 type of vision that you have that you're working up to you know always be mindful of the people that antagonize you with those things okay so stick to your purpose stick to your purpose know who you are be true to yourself and you'll be okay i really hope that y'all can hear me oh my god i got my earphones in i do not want to have to redo this video but y'all have y'all a blessed day god bless y'all and i love y'all thank you